Part three. <laughs> Here we go. Um, so this is part three of, again, us opening our full-time centre. Um, if you haven't seen it in other like bio and, and other videos and stuff. Um, we're in Leicester in the UK, um, just in case people abroad see this uh, and were wondering where we are. If you couldn't tell from how I talk. <laughs> um, but yeah, so things like finding a place let's go let's go down that route for part three actually finding a location um now for this i need to very briefly talk about how the club has worked up until like this point okay so we run clubs that like we like satellite locations now if you don't know what they are it basically means that the club exists and all your locations are you are essentially hiring halls or similar um like around a certain point so for us because we're leicester based if you say like leicester city center which is where this place is okay you have like a certain radius and then we have classes in within that radius so if you know leicester we've got stuff in le3 which is like braunston uh new parks glenfield braunston frith that kind of way we've then got stuff in le12 which is mount sorrel okay which is further sort of North West, I have to think about that <laughs> when you look at the map. Yeah, and then we've got stuff right over Eastway um, in like Fleckney and Houghton on the Hill. So all our locations kind of spread out. So the whole idea behind this place was let's get somewhere in the middle. <laughs> okay, so it means that when we run things like gradings, seminars, stuff like that, we've got a fixed location that's kind of in the middle of everybody that everyone can come to. So everyone can see everybody else that trains around the club. Because often people in Fleckney don't necessarily see people from Mount Sorrel or from LE3. Because it's like 45 minutes away in the car and you've got to drive either through or around the city centre. And again, in this day and age, fuel costs, people don't want to do it. <laughs> and I don't blame them. I'm going to be honest. Yeah, And it's not exactly an easy bicycle ride either. Okay, So we wanted to plonk something in the middle and go, right, let's find somewhere here. We needed somewhere that was had an open enough space for mats. Now, there's not a ton of mats, not really, because in some, I mean, I've seen some places like 300 mats down, they're massive. Whole thing's matted. We've got like 70. <laughs> but it's enough space for a class, for a seminar, for some technical gradings, that kind of stuff. Okay? If we need somewhere big, like, yeah, we'll go and hire a, a really big school sports hall or something. But yeah finding the place was or finding the right place was key